And then you've got the, these who owes you. So the accounts receivable, aging detail, the accounts summary, these are typically internal reports, meaning oftentimes we might not be generating these reports if we're gonna patch them up and give them to a client because they may not want to know the receivable detail unless they have a specific need for that. It's not part of the normal financial statements. I mean, it could be if you get into a detailed audit, you know, audited financial statement, but oftentimes these are gonna be more internal kind of reports, such as collection reports, internal report, customer balance uh, detail, usually gonna be an internal report, customer balance summary, typically that's for internal use to help us to collect and so on. The open invoices, that's usually for internal reporting purposes, not usually something we're gonna be patching together to present to a client on a monthly basis and so on for those items. Uh, so notice that we did, however, make this customer balance summary into a pie chart, right? So that is one of those things that we could make into like a pie chart and say, this is how who owes us what from the customer side. But most likely the more popular pie charts are gonna be the sales related pie charts if you're gonna be adding one. So that's gonna be down here. 